Hello everybody, Plastic Anarchy here. Today we'll be taking a look at the Brickmania AH-1G Cobra Gunship. Let's jump right into it. So first off, let's take a look at the box. AH-1G Cobra Gunship, designed by Dan Siskin, 459 LEGO and Brick Arms Elements. And on the back you have the disclaimer, quality guarantee, all of that kind of stuff. So yeah, let's open it right up. I had to pull out my big boy knife for this one, boys and girls. This wasn't a little plastic Brickmania box. We have to be serious around here. Look at this. This is an unboxing knife. So inside the box, we have the large bag of bricks, small bag of bricks, the instruction manual, and of course, the sticker sheet. So the build took me about an hour. But I was listening to music and having fun, like you should do when you're building LEGO kits. But yeah, it was pretty difficult compared to LEGO, of course, but nothing off the par of Brickmania kits. Here's the completed kit. As you can see, it features two identical minifigures. Let's take a look at them. Here's the front, the back, the left, and then the right side. Here's a look at the figures inside of the helicopter. Here's a look at the left side and the right side of the helicopter. As you can see, this kit features spinning rotors on the top and the tail, posable nose gun, and posable side mountain missile pods. But the missile pods fall off extremely easily. Here's a look at the decals that are featured in the kit. As you can see, there's a battle damage one, and of course, there's the sharp mouth on the nose of the gunship. I really, really like how these decals came out, and they are extremely high quality decals. They're not going to fall off or peel off like Lego decals usually do. And they cling to the bricks extremely easily. Now because this is a Brick Mania kit, of course the minifigures are going to be kind of difficult to get inside. It's not as difficult as the land vehicles that Brick Mania has produced, but it's a lot more difficult than putting a minifigure in a Lego helicopter or a Lego airplane. Here's a look at the flight controls. I really like how these decals came out. I would like to point out that this kit is extremely sturdy and of course it's extremely swooshable. This kit is available on Brickmania.com for $235 US dollars. It features two custom minifigures and an exclusive sticker sheet. This is a very high quality kit. The pros definitely outweigh the cons. Obviously it looks really good and really accurate to its real life counterpart. And it includes those two figures and that sticker sheet that I mentioned before. The only real cons, I would say, are that the missile pods and the nose gun fall off very, very easily. And that it's a little bit difficult to get your figures inside. Otherwise, I would definitely recommend this kit to any Vietnam or aviation LEGO fan. Alright everybody, that's it for today's review. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more videos like this in the future, feel free to subscribe. Massive thanks to Brickmania for sponsoring this video and providing this kit. You guys can check them out in the links below, along with my Instagram and Twitter. Once again, thanks for watching. I'm Plastic Anarchy, signing off. You're never too young to have a Vietnam flashback. Yeah.